I would like to introduce our technical marketing manager, Rajiv, to give you more detail of why MSI and how MSI. Thank you, Andy. Appreciate it. All right, everybody. I really want to go over a lot of the cool features that we have here. Before I get, in, uh, get way too into it, uh, we do have all of this stuff ready to demo at the end of the presentation, and I will be there to answer any questions along with the rest of our team with all this new technology that we want to show. So as Andy stated, we do have a full product stack available, and at the high end, or sorry, with the Sandy Bridge, one of the major focus that we want to do is with overclocking, right? We have the K-series uh, CPUs. When you see K on it, you know you can unlock it, and you can take it farther. And MSI is going to show you ways to do it easier and faster and better than anybody else. So as I said here, along with MSI's full product stack, we also have Intel's full you know, uh, CPU stack as well, with the K-series as I mentioned, and tons of others. The combinations and the number of combinations you can put together is staggering. You're going to have options for any price range, and we're going to see performance numbers that are really topping current generation processors, and we're really excited about what MSI can add to that as well. So as a, you know, some of you may be familiar with our Big Bang series. This is our flagship model. This is kind of the ultimate motherboard. It has everything on it, and with Sandy Bridge, it's no different. We have what's called the Big Bang Marshall, and we really, really want to show you some of the stuff that we have here today. We have a live demo. Let's do a quick breakdown. This is just, again, just kind of grazing over the top. We do have the Power 4 architecture that Andy mentioned before from the graphics card and putting it on our motherboard as well. This one has 12 USB 3.0. 12, that's a lot. We also want to go overboard with eight PCI Express by 16s. And these are powered with additional bridge chips to you know, supply those lanes. And again, world's first triple BIOS backup, ultimate stability and reliability on MSI platform, as well as the UEFI BIOS, which I'll be talking about very shortly. So let's, let's kind of you know, talk about something that we're really proud of. In 2010, we did a big initiative called Military Class Components. And this was a build philosophy where MSI said, this is the backbone of your system. We're going to provide you the best components on it to ensure that you have the best computing experience. And Military Class 1 was award winning worldwide. Brought MSI you know, a lot of accolades. A lot of you guys reviewed those products. And I know I was very happy to kind of share your awards. And now with the Sandy Bridge, we're moving to the next generation, Military Class 2. And this kind of starts again back to what I said, the philosophy. Back in 2008, we introduced what was called Dr. Moss. This is a driver MOSFET, provides cleaner energy, better energy, and just a better build quality. And back then, you know, a lot of people didn't give us too much attention, but we know we had something good. Fast forward to 2011, all of our competition is now including Dr. Moss on their products, under different names, of course. They don't want to take, you know, they don't want to give us credit. But fun, funny enough, while they were bringing in our product onto this generation, we're already miles ahead of them. And Military Class 2 is kind of starting that. And so with Military Class 1, what we have different on Military Class 2 is we've increased our choke. We've improved our choke. And it's now a dynamic switching choke called Super Ferrite Choke. This was only found on flagship models of the Big Bang series. And now you can get it on a mainstream pl a platform with the full Sandy Bridge line. What does SFC do? Well, it allows you to do either 10% power efficiency if you're a basic user, or if you're an overclocker, like I know some of you guys are, 30% power boost. So again, whatever type of user you are, the MSI solution is going to be the best for you. And again, as I said before, you'll always see that nice little sexy SFC on our boards. I don't know what you're going to see on the other guys, but it just, you know, it looks the same old thing. So again, you're going to see us making big, big steps ahead of everybody else. Not only that, but one of the big staple features of Military Class 1 was using tantalum capacitors. These are solid state capacitors with a low profile, provides extreme cooling, provides the best power supply to the chipset and the CPU. And again, we're bringing that back, right? It's been doing so well. And this is kind of the staple component of Military Class 2. And why we call it Military Class 2? Because high C caps are used in mission critical situations. The application for high C caps and military class components in general 
NASA space shuttles, military defense systems, medical servers, medical stations, things that just cannot fail. And we believe that if these components do not fail for the high end, you guys deserve the same quality. And that's what MSI brings on military class two. So again, well again, this is kind of a repeating thing. You're gonna see a lot of the things where we're moving ahead, we're taking you know, light years beyond our competition. And not only is military class on our motherboards, it's on video cards too. So our full component product line benefits from this build philosophy. And we're very excited to bring that to you. And now why do, you, you know, why do we provide these better build quality? We want you to have the best performance around. As you saw, as Mr. Lou mentioned, in 1987, we, know we did create the first overclocking board. And we've been pushing and trying to provide and build a bridge to bring any type of user into this enthusiast room. And we've done just that with OC Genie. OC Genie allows anybody in this room to be an overclocker at the touch of a button. That's all it requires. If you can push a button, you can overclock an MSI motherboard. And what does OC Genie do? Well, let's look at that. By default, if I'm running a 3.4 gigahertz processor, all I do is push a button and I get 4.2 gigahertz. That's it. Stable, reliable, functional. That's, and it, again, easy. And we like to see that as bridging the gap to allow more people to see the exciting technology that we've built behind our motherboards. Well, there's also the H67, which provides onboard video. Does OC Genie do anything for that? Absolutely. It provides a GPU boost to the internal graphics and gives you better performance. And so the 3D mark shows that you're getting a better boost. Casual gaming gets benefited from that as well. So OC Genie is a full, fully fleshed out overclocking tool that it's only on MSI motherboards. Now, I know some of you guys are like, well, I don't want to push a button. I want to do more. I want to go back to the roots. I want to get back in there, get in there, and do all the little tweaks. I didn't forget about you, neither did we, neither did MSI. We have tools for you, and they're new, and they're better, and they're more fun. And that's Control Center 2. Control Center 2 is an application that you can do everything, monitor, overclock, push your system to the limits within Windows. No reboot necessary. You change your settings, hit apply, and it goes. Monitor it live from Windows, and everything is there for you visible. Very great. System temperatures, anything you can think of, Control Center 2 can do. Individual fan speed controls based on the headers. We've thought it all, and we want, and this has also been part of your feedback. So again, thanks to you guys for that one. What else do we have? Hey, you know what? How about UEFI? UEFI is a big thing here, and MSI introduced it originally on P45. And now, we're really fleshed it out for the Sandy Bridge platform. And so UEFI, or what we call Click BIOS, is a standard part of all of our Sandy Bridge boards. And so it's a great interface. You guys will have live demos later on to check it out, click around, see what it's about. But it replaces the 